is Bob Davis 321 with my latest uh, Arduino scope setup. We're running 60 kilohertz through a TL082, I do believe. 032 dual op amp TLC 5510 analog to digital converter, 16 megahertz clock. Arduino Uno out to a 1.8 TFT screen. Um, at sine wave, oh, up here is push buttons. Like if I push this, it's going to change my phase. Go up here and change my trigger level. I can go down here, change my delay. Although I notice it actually runs off the right hand of the screen. It's about 196, 286. 98, well, whatever. Losing focus. Back to a delay of zero. That's a square wave performance, or sine wave performance. There's a square wave performance. Lower it down a little bit. Pretty sharp, eh? Uh, triangle wave. Uh, sawtooth. Reverse sawtooth. Here's a funny one too. I'll show you something interesting. If you go back to the sine wave. You can see it there for a second. When you overload the sine wave, the analog to digital converter does something really weird. And of course, I need to point out that this is 8 bits of resolution. So we've got 256 steps, although we're only able to display 128 of them on this LCD screen. So anyways, there we have it. My latest Arduino oscilloscope using the TLC5510 and that TL032 op amp on the front end really improves the uh, noise figure. I mean, it's nice and smooth and sharp, even on a square wave. And uh, you can see I got my trigger circuitry working really good. When I first got the trigger working, it would kick in and kick out depending upon whether or not the uh, computer was connected or uh, D0 and D1 from the analog to digital converter was connected and I've uh, resolved that issue. It's really quite simple. As you can kind of see D0 and D1 are going through 1k ohm resistors to the analog to digital converter. That way you can connect the computer and the analog to digital converter at the same time and not have any problems. I just disconnected the computer to see if it would cause it to spaz out on the sink, but it doesn't. Or trigger phase. So there we have it, my latest uh, oscilloscope.